Hey guys, this is LA now. A little bit around. It's just some um, alley between a few houses. And this now is my job, I'm doing something. <laughs> what I'm doing is, um, I have to take this, I almost emptied it already. There's some stuff, they um, took a layer of uh, cement or concrete off the uh, balcony because it was cracking. And they put in a new layer on it, so I have to take all these rocks to the trash, to the dumpster. And we have here also some, and I have the shovel right, right down there, you see it? And all this trash I also have to put at the end up to the, I mean inside the dumpster. So anyways, I'll try to do something, and let me see if it's gonna work. Uh -huh. so it should be able to watch me. Okay, anyways, now, uh, anyways, uh, so, this is, uh, I see this channel, sometimes people will get confused. Because it's, okay, now someone doesn't know how they're gonna go through, okay, because uh, there's a car, two cars, and people get confused. Okay, move, move, move along. Okay, so that I have peace, right, talking to you, because that's what I'm trying to do now. So anyways, yeah, people sometimes get to my channel and they see Ocean of Heart, right, and they get confused, like probably they think, oh, what a nice, sweet guy, you know, <laughs> and I am sweet, yeah, also. <laughs> so you see what I'm doing now? I'm shoveling this stuff. And uh, sometimes I see people, a lot of times people want to um, build their muscles, you know. And I say, they actually, they actually know why they're doing it. Is it really only for the muscles so that you can show the muscle or stuff like that? Uh, it's actually the mentality towards life, you know, I mean, it's your mentality. What is your mentality? Are you gonna get, you know, um, down and dirty, you know? Are you gonna feel sorry for yourself in life? That's a big question. And um, I don't know how much you can hear me, you know, but when you actually do the physical exercise, you are doing something that um, is stabilizing your spirit within you. And, um, something that shows your toughness, your realness, you know what I mean? And uh, if you're scared to grab things, you know, in a physical point of view, it's because they might be dirty or they might be rough or sharp, you know? <laughs> that means that's your attitude towards life. So if you have such an attitude, then whatever comes your way, it's most likely too much for you, right? So, but I mean, this you know, here, ocean of heart, is to help you be tough, you know, to be tough, you know what means tough? It doesn't mean you have to be mean, it doesn't mean you have to be evil, man, but tough, you know, really tough. I'm not trying to be tough, you know, now, but it's kind of the symbolism of all the physical work and uh, even the workout, even if I be lifting weights right now, it's the same thing, you see, that's my mentality, you know, I don't care what comes in my life my way, you know what I mean? When it comes, I deal with it, BAM! You know, straight ahead. What? No, you know what I mean? What? That's the mentality. Because that's, that's the way it is. I mean, I can't sit down and cry. Because it's not gonna help me. It's gonna help me in a moment, you know, to release the pressure, you know, to um, accept the emotions. And then I just have to get up and, you know, face it. And uh, some people would say, yeah, you can talk like that because your life is okay. <laughs> yeah, my life is okay because that's, you know, it's not always so okay, but I mean, even even when it's okay, it's okay because <laughs> the way I am, you know what I mean? So, uh, yeah, but this ocean of heart, you see, sometimes I was thinking, like, do people don't even, I mean, do people actually really understand what this means, ocean of heart, or do they think that this, you know, because sometimes heart, you know, the word heart, has this like nice symbol, you know, the red one, or some pink heart, you know. <laughs> but ocean of heart is everything in life, you know what I mean? It's the ocean of life, you know, you could say, because heart is like a symbol for life, you know? The heart represents, I don't know why the heart represents to people this symbol of life, 
because actually even some people hmm, some people have oh, you know their heart is okay but they hurt some other part of the body or they get some sickness or disease and the heart is still okay but they still die <laughs> you know so obviously the heart is not the life but okay I mean you know let, let's say the heart is life okay so you could also say the ocean of life you know what I mean? It's like, you know, the ocean of life, w what is that, you know? What do you think that is? It's just everything, you know what I mean? Everything that life is. <laughs> so now it might be crap, or it might be beauty. Whichever you want, whichever you you uh, like to accept. I just accept all of them. Have a good time, okay? I gotta go back to work. They kick me out, they say, okay, you came here to work now, you're blubbering in front of the camera. What is that? What is this? Are you a mannequin or a model or something? <laughs> you know, because they don't know. Maybe they think this guy's crazy talking to himself. So uh, have a good time. You know, I gotta get some time. You know, free time so that I can give you also some other stuff. Uh, I mean, give you, <laughs> share with you. Okay. <laughs> Bye. So guys, you know, take a shovel and shovel your crap because it's yours. You know, like this. Let me show you how. No mercy and no self-pity, you know. Like this, you see? Decision, decision and courage and power, you know. No victims, you know what I mean? Winners. That's what it takes in life. And it's not gonna do it. Ain't no one is gonna do it for you. You do it for yourself. Because like I said, it's yours. We all shower our own crap. No one else's. So don't wait for me to come shovel yours because it's gonna be tough. <laughs>